Jasmine's behavior of chasing the four-wheeler and barking and biting the tires has become very problematic. It is dangerous and for her as well as for anyone riding the four-wheeler. Jasmine's owners chose to administer punishment for this behavior in the form of a training collar that delivers electric shock. This worked very well to stop Jasmine from chasing the four-wheeler, but an interesting artifact was discovered. Remember the discriminative stimulus? Well, Jasmine will not chase the four-wheeler or bite at its tires as long as she is wearing the shock collar. Now, wearing the shock collar, when the four-wheeler starts, Jasmine runs along on the road near the four-wheeler, but gives it a wide berth. She doesn't bark, she doesn't bite at the tires, in fact she prefers to stay far away while it's moving. This illustrates one of the problems with the use of punishment for shaping behavior. With the use of the shock collar to train her, Jasmine didn't really learn to stop barking and biting at the tires of the four-wheeler. She learned to not bark or bite at the tires of the four-wheeler while she's wearing the shock collar.